Russian solder will be target at Zaporizhzhia nuclear power plants. Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky has said his force will target Russian solder, who shoot at or from Europe's largest nuclear power station, amid warning that the Kremlin may falsely claim Kyiv has directly struck the critical site. Zelensky said anyone giving orders for attack on the site or nearby towns and cities should face trial by an international court as concern about the safety of the nuclear site remained high. Every Russian soldier who either shoots at the plant or shoot using the plant as cover must understand that he becomes a special target for our intelligence agents, for our special services, for our army, Jelensky said in a video addressed on Saturday night. He called for new sanctions against Russia that would necessarily block the Russian nuclear industry. And he argued that absolutely all officials of the territory state, as well as those who helped them in his blackmail operation with the nuclear power plant, must be tried by an international court. Russian troops captured the station, the biggest nuclear plants in Europe, responsible for up to 20% of Ukraine's energy needs earlier in the war. Two of its six reactors are currently operating, and Ukraine has said Russia is trying to reconnect the power plant to occupy Crimea and shut off electricity supply to towns held by Kiev. Footage has shown Russian forces present on the nuclear site, Ukrainian control Nikopol and other towns across the Dnir River have come under intense bombardment in the last month from Russian held side from the plant and the nearby settlement of Vodian. Local officials have warned that Russia is trying to prepare a false flag operation relating to the nuclear site. Dmitry Arlov, the major of Enerholder, the city where the Zaporizhzhia reactor site is located, said people had told him that Russian had positioned a self propel artillery gun with a Ukrainian flag in the city. Locals still in the city crowded the road on the way out of Enerholder on Saturday, according to social media videos, reflecting concerns that the conflict between the two sides would escalate further. The Ukrainian presidential adviser Mikhailo Podolyak accused Russia of targeting the part of the nuclear power plant where the energy that powers of the south of Ukraine is generated. The goal is to disconnect us from plants and blame the Ukrainian army for this, Podolyak said. The International Atomic Energy Agency, which is seeking to inspect the plant, has warned of a possible nuclear disaster at less fighting stop. Nuclear experts fear fighting might damage the plant's spent fuels pools or the reactors, although the concrete wall of Key's areas are designed to withstand substantial impact. On Sunday, 42 countries including the US, Japan and the UK plus European Union call on Russia to immediately withdraw military forces from the plant and the entire country to safeguard the site. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.